In Singapore, some nursing homes are relying less on air conditioning to combat the heat. Instead, they're ramping up other means to deal with the warm weather, including using portable air coolers. One nursing home is even looking at bigger changes to its building to cope with rising temperatures. Most nursing homes in Singapore do not use air conditioning in their facility. That's because elderly residents have different medical conditions, with some being prone to feeling cold. With the threat of viral transmissions, most wards are naturally ventilated. Instead, most homes have opted for portable air coolers. These air coolers are set to bring down temperatures by about 4 degrees Celsius. But the NTUC Health nursing home at Chai Chi wants to go one step further. We are looking at bringing in the thermal frames for the windows and uh, the cooling panes for the building facade because of the recent heat wave. And hopefully with the cooling pane, uh, it can help to reduce the ambient temperature around the building. These thermal films are already in place at the Chai Chi nursing home. NTUC Health hopes to install such window films at more branches. Cooling paint costs more than normal paint, but it's capable of lowering the temperature within a building by 2 degrees Celsius. At the Taihua Kwan Nursing Home, its sensory room for residents with dementia is also being used as a makeshift heat shelter. It's one of the few rooms in the nursing home with air conditioning. The nurses here are also stepping up the residents' hydration routine. We will continue to also take uh, to check the parameters of our patients to make sure that they are not dehydrated. Uh, on top of that, uh, we also do uh, what they term as a water parade uh, to load up on liquids um, for the day. Such water parades have become more frequent. Water and isotonic drinks are served hourly instead of the usual two-hourly routine.